Wow, do we have problems. We have problems. Uh, highway 400 northbound, there is no access to uh, the northbound from 401 eastbound. And that is all because of the issues that you see behind me. We've got a couple of transport trucks blocking lanes. Uh, they can't make it up this ramp and because there's been no traffic, uh, the snow is drifting up and uh, it's obviously causing all kinds of issues for everybody. Now, again, behind me here, you can see we've got traffic jammed up here on the 401 eastbound collectors. Traffic is not moving at all. The scary thing right there, I got an ambulance right there. Ambulance can, you know, is, is slow. But I've heard sirens with vehicles not able to get to their destinations and there's a hospital nearby and I hope they can make it to where they're going. These trucks have been uh, here since probably 7 or 8 this morning. They're not going anywhere until we get heavy tows and we got this guy, Mr. Four Wheel Drive, don't hit that truck. All right. Well, hope you can make it through. <clears throat> I'm not sure if he's going to stop. He's lucky. All right. <laughs> so, uh, a little bit of uh, frustration there. Of course, one person goes. Now, we'll see if we can get some more cars coming through here. But uh, that's what we're dealing with. 401 eastbound collectors. No traffic getting, getting through here to the 401, to the 400 northbound. Uh, and then the 401 eastbound collectors approaching Keel Street jammed as well. We got one driver here. I was up on top watching you before. I'm just live here. How long have you been sitting here in traffic? 7.15 a.m. From 7.15 this morning? Yes. Okay. You got a uh, cell phone charger? Uh, died on me. Okay. Do you have any food, granola bars? Zero. Emergency kit? Zero. Did you know there was a snowstorm coming? Last night, I did, we were looking at the weather, but we didn't think it was going to come up this bad. <laughs> and so where did you start from? Uh, Burnham Thorpe and East Mall. So you made it away. 7 o'clock, it was still dark. Yeah. Uh, and you've been stuck here for about six hours. Yes, sir. <laughs> Should have stayed home. Should have stayed home. Oh, boy. And I don't know when help is going to be on its way. So, anyways, we'll, uh, we're going to just take a little walk here. Stay warm, stay dry, keep your exhaust pipe clear. Yes, and I know you, you're not going to get up here. You've been trying for been trying. six to seven hours already. So, you know, that's the frustration. Look, the snow banks here right now. You know, just look at this. Look at the amount of snow, you know, and this guy's been fighting forever. Uh, <clears throat> I was actually on top of this overpass here about an hour ago. And uh, we'll see how these guys, how's everybody doing? How long you been here? Uh, since about 9.30. 9.30? Okay. Yeah. You got help coming? No. No, I was hoping a heavy record get these guys in front of me and I might be able to walk over. No, I okay. can back up a bit. Okay, yeah. Maybe get a run, but I don't know. Yeah, it's it's a mess up there. Oh, yeah, that. it's a mess. So, are you loaded? No, I empty. Empty, empty so back. you have no, no weight back no there. Weight. Oh, good luck. Okay, well, it's going to be a while yet. Yeah, I know. All right, so... This ramp is shut down all the way back to Weston Road and then some, and then the 401 eastbound is shut down, not shut down, but is blocked and restricted all the way along, you know, along the 401. So we've got big problems here right now. Hey guys, don't you wish you stayed home today? Yeah, I'm stuck here for like six hours. You've been here six hours? I'm live on Periscope and Facebook right now. Uh, did you know the storm was coming? Yeah, we knew that, but you don't know those two trucks too much stuck in. So can you get through here? Now you've been, are you in the cube vent? Yeah, yeah. I've, been, I've been watching you. You've been, you can't I'm even move. Yeah. yeah, no, you can't even go yourself. So, should it, No shovel trucks or like... Well, plows truck. can't get through. Plows can't get through because uh, you're here. You're the one blocking everybody. How many guys do we need to help push? Could, could this guy move if you get out of the way? Maybe. If he moves, but I know, I know. Yeah, yeah. He he can't get get anywhere. So hey, you know we we got major trouble here, and 
and sadly all we see here is cars blocked up all the way up there <laughs> I'm not roasting anybody I'm just hey they they knew it was gonna snow uh, I feel bad for these guys okay he's giving me a thumbs up he doesn't want to talk to me but uh, so this is the ramp to the 400 northbound you come down at this ramp normally you hit those rumble strips reminding you to slow down because we get rollovers here from time to time but uh, we also see hey how you doing no progress, not doing no, progress five is hours now. oh I know I know five hours yes sir what do you got in the back nothing empty. you're empty oh boy you're slipping and sliding all over the place so yeah uh, we gotta wait for big trucks to come up here plows to get in here uh, how long would it take I don't know. Any idea? Rough idea. I don't want to give you an estimate because then you're going to hold me to it. Uh, <laughs> I. Do you have food? Yes, I have. Do you have charger for your phone? Yes. You got fuel? I have. Okay. Yeah. All right. Stay warm. Okay. Uh, I keep following us. I'm, we're doing a live on Periscope and Twitter. Do you want to say hi to everybody? Hi, everybody. Got stuck here for more than five hours now. Five hours. Five hours. Yes. Oh man. Oh boy. It's it's getting nasty here again so hey everybody there is this is no snow joke here uh, you can see all the cars stuck in the background plus the cars uh, you can't even see yeah that's the 401 eastbound and then that's the four ramp to 400 northbound uh, yeah so you, know, you know our friends over here in this cube take care man stay warm look at the way these drifts are just like that's a four foot or three foot concrete wall there and these drifts have just come in here the plows cannot get through until these cars are cleared and and I'm just flogging oh, this guy's trying to roll now but he's not gonna get anywhere uh, I don't know uh, we need help are you making any progress? Nothing, okay. Well, just sit tight and uh, we'll try to get help up at the front. Oh, Heavy just showed up. There we go. We got a savior coming. All right, look at this. First sign of a heavy tow truck. So if we can get these trucks winched out of here, maybe we can start rolling. Uh, our angels. Yeah, heavies are right here. All right. First heavy truck just showed up. Yeah, yeah, I see that. That's good. Okay, so we'll go talk to these guys. I want to see how they've been making out. And then we'll uh, come back and show you what's going on the 401. But like we said this morning, stay home. Don't leave, don't leave. Okay. <laughs> He's gotta get to the high side so he can winch this truck from the bottom, from the low side here. Oh man, it's a mess here. How you doing my friend? Oh boy, you are an angel. Day. So how's your day going? You been busy? With everybody else. You been busy or crazy, crazy. can you get through traffic? I can get it's hard getting through traffic. It's hard? Yeah. Yeah. So are you gonna start winching these guys? I'm gonna start with this uh, tanker first. The tanker, yeah. I'm gonna get him up. Yeah. Then I'm gonna come back and get the, the red truck and work my way back. Okay. Awesome. I'm not gonna slow you down. No you can do it on your own? Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we got our first bit of uh Good news here. Let's get these trucks moving. On a day like this, that's what we need. 
<laughs> so uh, again, I'll let him keep doing his thing. He's gonna pull the cables. But again, look at this. These cars, they've been here for hours. And sorry, and just those are my knees. I am I am down in major drifts. Uh, yeah, there's going to be a lot of unhappy people stuck in that traffic. I hope everyone's prepared. And yeah, looking across the 401 there, all I see is stop traffic. Either no traffic or stop traffic. It's one or the other. And tow trucks here waiting to get these cars moving. But even where there's no traffic here, that's because there's stopped traffic somewhere else and the plow still haven't been able to get through here. Uh, are you making any progress? Behind the trucks in the 730. Oh boy. I'll come give you a hand. What's that? No. Okay, I'll see what I got. Okay. Sorry, I haven't, can't read any comments here. But, uh, you know, the snow had actually let off about an hour ago. It was actually pretty, uh, pretty wide open. Uh, but now it's coming down again. Okay, hang on. Whew. Stay safe and stay warm, thank you. Stay warm, stay safe. <laughs> take a break. I wish. I can't take a break, everyone else is stuck here. We gotta keep going. So, I'm gonna try to get back and give that guy a hand. See if I can get him rolling out of here because once that heavy, comes up with that truck he's gonna need that car gone and that's gonna be the next breaking point you know there's so many issues we're in the process Toronto Police Service right now is in the process of shutting down the Don Valley Parkway they already got the gardener shut down and they just need people off the highways they need to close the highways we need to close and, and uh, clear the traffic so we can get the plows through here to clear the snow and then we can start driving again but until such time when when we say essential traffic only or absolutely necessary traffic if you need to be out because of urgent matters that's one thing but if there's any way you can stay home it's probably too late now but we're dealing with it Gardeners open again? Oh, thanks. I didn't know that. I know they had it. They were working on shutting that down. Get warm. Yeah, fingers are cold here, but we'll make it work. Uh, once we get that tow pulling that uh, tanker up, we'll uh, hopefully get that other little blue car moving as well. And um, uh, that's it. Yeah, we got some heavy rescue crews here as well uh, trying to document what's going on. We don't want to shut down the roads, but drivers got to make decisions and understand what they're getting themselves into. I've been going all day. I've been getting around and I don't have four wheel drive. I have snow tires. I turn off my traction control and I watch where I'm going and I haven't had any problems. I've had to slow down and stop because of other traffic in front of me, but uh, I've been moving. And unfortunately, we've got far too many people out there with uh, summer slicks, low suspensions. They're hanging up on the snow drifts. Uh, they're not driving. They're they're driving with such caution or hesitation. They they get hung up on the snowbanks, and, and they don't know how to get themselves going again. Uh, I've been telling everyone 
to turn off your traction control and once you do that usually they can actually get themselves rolling again so just little bits of advice here but uh, again the situation is not that great and we've got uh, more work to do so on the evening I don't know it's gonna be a continuation of today uh, anyways that's it I hope you're at home nice and warm yeah, I think everybody here on the roads <laughs> wishes they were they were doing the same thing take care everybody nice to talk to you and uh, again get an emergency kit this is your this is your opportunity get a shovel get some boots get some gloves get a pack of granola bars um, the water might freeze but uh, get some fluids uh, put a go buy a spare charging cord everyone's always looking for charging cords and cables and, and uh, battery packs uh, and, and they're taking them from one to another get one and dedicate it into an emergency pack so that when you need it you can charge your phone in case a cable breaks or you forget it one morning so yeah people were shelving for three hours don't have a heart attack and uh, <laughs> You know, this it's there's lots of snow and it's kind of heavy, and uh, people are working hard and they're struggling everywhere in the cold, uh, with with out the equipment that they need. So, I'm going to sign off for now. That's it. We'll take care. Talk to you soon.